Welcome to Clever. Clever lets you turn your 3D models into interactive presentations that you can share with other people in the cloud. In this video, we're going to look at how to create a presentation from 3ds Max. First, you're going to need the Clever for 3ds Max plugin. You can get it by logging into your Clever account. Switch to the 3ds Max tab and click the Get Plugin link. Once the file has downloaded, unzip it to your desktop. To install the plugin, double click on the .exe file. An installation wizard will pop up. Just follow the on-screen prompts. You can uninstall the plugin in the same way. Now launch 3ds Max. The Clever settings will appear as a floating toolbar the first time you install the plugin. You can dock it anywhere you want in the interface. If I right click on the viewport label, you can see that this scene already has cameras set up. These will be replicated in the Clever presentation, enabling viewers to navigate it. To export the scene to Clever, click the cube icon. Clever will prompt you to log into your account. Click Log In to launch a browser window. Once you are logged into your account, click Authorize. The scene should now begin to upload. The process can take a couple of minutes, so we've sped it up. You should now see a rendered 3D view of your scene. You can navigate it by holding down the left mouse button to rotate the camera view. Holding down the right mouse button pans the camera. The scroll wheel zooms in and out. You can switch between the camera views set up in 3ds Max by expanding the right hand menu and clicking Cameras. Just click on the names in the list to switch between them. You can also switch between cameras by clicking their icons in the viewport. If you expand the bottom toolbar, you will see a range of display quality options. Amongst other things, these let you set the screen resolution, choose different display styles, adjust post-production settings like gamma and exposure, or take a screenshot of the current view. The two icons at the top of the screen let you download the presentation to your workstation and to upload it to your Clever workspace in the cloud. Uploading the presentation to the cloud lets you share it with other people. Click on the icon and select your workspace from the drop-down. You can give the presentation a name by typing in the lower field. When you're done, click Upload Model. Again, this can take a couple of minutes. Once the upload is complete, open your web browser and log into your Clever account. You should see the scene that you just uploaded in your workspace. To share it with other people, click on the three dots on the right of the thumbnail and choose Share Project. To invite someone to the presentation, type their email address into the top field. Choose whether you want them to be able to edit the presentation, to comment on it, or only to view it. And when you're ready, click Add, and then Done. An email with a link to the project will now be sent to your collaborator. To view the presentation from your own workspace, click on the thumbnail, and then click View Project. Again, the scene can take a couple of minutes to load. Once the presentation loads, you will see that you have most of the same options that you did in the Clever Viewer. If you open the right-hand menu, you will see that you have the option to create annotations. Annotations let you add notes to a project. To add one, select Create One Now, and then click anywhere in the viewport. Now you can type a message for your other collaborators. As well as entering text in the top two fields, you can select Include Current View to attach a thumbnail screenshot. When you're done, 
Click Save. Your annotation should now appear in the right-hand menu. And that's it. You've just created and shared your first interactive project with Clever.